Well, hello everyone. Today being a beautiful day and it being springtime still and everything is green and beautiful, I thought I would make a flower crown um, for no other reason than I think they're beautiful. So the supplies I've gathered and, and uh, hope I've get, got everything I need is a piece of wire which I cut more or less to, let me put this down, to um, the size of my head. So there it is, some wire cutters, <clears throat> an assortment of different colored flowers. These are all from Do Dollar Tree and some floral ribbon. I honestly don't remember where I bought this, um, but I know it's not expensive. So I'm going to start, oops, this one's messed up, scissors, scissors. Um, by taking floral wire and wrapping the piece of uh, wire that I've measured to the size of my head. Um, so that aesthetic, aesthetically, aesthetically, aesthetically it will be more pleasing and it'll be um, softer on your head. So I'm just kind of wrapping this Floral wire, I understand, um, doesn't wrap or doesn't stick to anything but itself. So it has limited uses. But this, of course, is green, you can see. I guess they make it in different colors. You know what? Rather than keep it on the roll, I'm just going to cut off a piece and then cut off another piece if I, as I need it. But so I'm going to wrap this all the way till the end, and then I'll turn the video camera back on and show you the next steps. Okay, so I've wrapped this um, entire piece of wire, which as I said earlier, I measured to about the size of my head. Uh, it's going to be adjustable, however. so. The head measure measurement doesn't have to be too precise, and this is going to be made so it can fit um, a lot of different size heads. So to begin, um, or to continue, I should say, I'm going to make a little loop like that on both ends. And then I'm going to start the process um, of wrapping. So probably should have cut some of these ahead of time, but I wasn't really sure how many um, I would need. So and I don't want to pull them all apart. Actually, you can pull them right, you know, off the stems of these flowers. We want to make uh, sure to get some leaves in here, though. So I'm going to start with this white one, just because it appeals to me. No other reason. So I'm going to take it and I'm going to um, attach it with this floral tape. I could have sworn I bought another one. I know I did. I just don't know where I put it. But I think I have plenty here. So I should be okay. I'm going to take a small piece. <clears throat> and I've got, um, well, let me cut off this little peripheral, peripheral piece which I don't need. Actually, cut it a little shorter, closer to the stem. Oh, come on. That's what my little six-year-old granddaughter says a lot. Oh, come on. She's so cute. All my grandkids are cute. cute. And I'm actually going to make one of these for her and for my younger, um, my older grandchild, Justine. And maybe if Morgan ever comes home from the Navy, if she wants one, I can make her one. So, um, yeah, those are my three granddaughters. So, I'm wrapping this at the end. You just want to make it secure, you know? I'll probably wind up putting another flower on the end here because otherwise there's going to be too much wire showing. Okay. 
And of course you're gonna make some adjustments um, as you go and then at the end take another little piece of floral tape and put it in the middle here so I'm kind of going in between the flowers just to secure it and you just have to put it put the tape whoops came right off just have to put the tape in logical places to secure the flowers onto the frame and at the very end I'm going to shape it as best I can into the round shape that it should be there we go so that's how it's looking so far and I'll continue in the same fashion, um, selecting different color flowers as I go, and I'll come back and show you my progress. Okay, so I'm done affixing the uh, artificial flowers to the wire. It's nice and round now. And what I did is I tied some ribbon um, on the very end, and that way um, whoever wears this can adjust it to their own um, head size and then they can have pretty ribbons um, dangling and on the back of their head so I thought it came out very pretty and uh, there you go something for spring and summer for some young ladies to wear